how would that have impeded the investigation to say that he was responding to a 911 call? I would only say this, once you, once you lift the edge of the tent and let the camel's nose in, where do you stop? Well, if you're going to tell me that, why don't you tell me this? Well, you just told me that. Why don't you tell me this? What's wrong with telling me that? What's wrong with telling me the other? That's where you end up with this arbitrary but justifiable, no comment on an ongoing criminal investigation, regardless of, 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 of how, how benign it might appear to you. One comment leads to the other and to the other, and then a response from somebody else. And before long, you, you, have, you have broached the confidentiality with which everybody wanted this investigation conducted, especially the district attorney. Let the truth come out in due course, and that's exactly what we did, sir. Well, we can always go back and, and say if I had a chance to do it again, I would do it this way and that way. And I certainly believe in transparency and, and that we ought to reveal as much as we can. So that's some lessons I'm sure that we learned from this incident that will hopefully nothing like this ever occurs again, but we'll, we'll know how to do things better. Uh, this incident has brought to the forefront um, a, a, a lack of respect, a lack of trust, and a lack of confidence uh, by people in, in our community. And everybody needs to have faith and confidence and certainty that they will be treated appropriately and that justice will be done. We don't need to have any segment of the community that is skeptical that justice is being done and that the police department is doing its dead level best and the city doing its dead level best to ensure that justice is done in every circumstance. Are we perfect? No. No, no organization or individual is, but we can always improve and we seek to do that. We seek to open an, an honest dialogue with the community to address the perception, and it may not be reality, but it is the perception that the police department is, is rude, that they are arrogant, that they are disrespectful. And in certain circumstances that, that, may, have, that may have occurred, but it's certainly not our intention to do that and we can all learn to do better. Uh, we need to have faith and confidence in the police department that preserves and protects us. Well, it seems that would you handle it differently? No, sir, I would not. You, I, I, I would not. When the, the, when, when the, when the, when the, the no, sir, I, I would not. I, I would, I would abide by the same rule. No comment on an ongoing criminal investigation. No comment. Not even benign. Well, what about? You know, a nine one. No, no, no. That's part of it. That's that's part of the incident that surrounded it. In fact, to be perfectly honest,